Hey guys, what's up? This is Sparks, and I'm going to be showing you guys how to install the Pengus or Penguins mod for Minecraft. So if you guys check out the link in the description, it'll bring you right to this website right here. Just check, click on the Penguins mod right in the description below. It's going to bring you right to this webpage here. This is the Penguins mod form page here. So if you guys um, go here and you go to see her to the download mod right here, it is currently in the version of Minecraft 1.6.2. So if you guys are wanting to, are you interested there? Um, just check out the very top title. Um, that will always say the, the which version is for right there. So currently 1.6.2 like that. Um, make sure you just scroll down here to the download mod, click on that, and save it onto your desktop, and it should look just like that. The Pengus mod right there. So for the next, um, for the next thing you guys actually need is Minecraft Forge. Minecraft Forge is required for this mod. So you guys click on the link in the description. It'll say Minecraft Forge. It's gonna bring you right here. I, I always recommend the recommended 1.6.2 version. Go to the installer. Click on the installer right there, and save it on your desktop just like that. You'll see Minecraft Forge installer. So after you guys have downloaded both of those things, what you need to do is open up the Minecraft Forge installer. It's gonna say install client right there. Push OK. You guys actually um, then you're gonna see successfully install client profile for forge push ok there you're done with the forge so for the next thing you need to do is actually um, I always recommend this open up minecraft um, make sure you guys are open up the minecraft the minecraft launcher and uh, as soon as it kind of loads I'll show you guys what you need to do anyway uh, man this just takes forever to load I don't know why anyway as soon as it pops up, it says I'm kind of logged in. All right, there we go. Go to edit profile. Then we're going to need to go to the used version. You see right here, used version. And you want to go down here. And it's usually going to say the uh, release, you know, whatever the newest release. Just make sure you scroll all the way down to the bottom. Do you see the forge? Click on the forge right there. Make sure you guys are using this version right here. Click save profile and click play. So that what basically what you're doing is your money is you're going to be running Minecraft with the Minecraft Forge installed. Now you need to do this at least once because it's going to create the necessary files and folders that, that are required for this mod. Um, and also, it's always a really good idea because you always want to make sure Minecraft is still working. Um, maybe you guys are using the wrong version of Forge or something like that. So I always recommend to start Minecraft up with Forge installed at least once. Um, because, you know, you just want to make sure it works and you need the folders that it's going to be creating. So as soon as it kind of gets there, as soon as it kind of gets done loading again, three mods loaded, three mods active. If you, if you see that on here, then you guys are really good. Just make sure you guys close Minecraft again. And for the next thing you need to do is actually need to install the mod. So what we're going to need to do is go down here to start. You want to type in a start. You want to type in percent a p p d a t a. That's percent app data and another percent. Once you guys have typed that in, what you're going to need to do is go up to here to the roaming folder right there. Click on that roaming folder. And this is where you're going to see the .minecraft folder right there. So you want to open up that .minecraft folder. And this is where you're going to see the mods folder. Now, if you guys don't have a mods folder in here, it's because you guys did not start Minecraft at least once with Forge installed. So that mods folder is created by the Forge being installed. So if you guys have that, um, then you guys will follow this video exactly like I showed you. But if you don't, make sure you just create a new folder and add the mods folder. Just all under caps and mods folder right there. Open up that mods folder. Make sure the folder is empty. And what you need to do is drag the Pingus mod right into that mods folder and you guys are completely done with this installation and you guys are ready to play so I'm gonna show you guys that it's actually working for me because I always like to do that in the video um, you know just just to show you guys that it is working for me because maybe I did something wrong maybe I need to correct that so I always like to start it up make sure it plays just fine um, if you guys are actually required or uh, if you guys actually want to as soon as it plays plays online come on play okay so if you guys actually want to install optifine with this mod there will be a link in the description for optifine um it'll just say um you guys want to install optifine with this and it'll take you to one of my videos um that i've ins i've already installed optifine it's, it's basically the same way um as this mod you know it's just there is some different things in it so if you guys want to install it with that just make sure you guys click on that and check it out all right so we're checking minecraft and it takes forever to load like always all right, four mods loaded, four mods active. It means it's installed correctly. You see the Pingus mod right there, which means it's ready to play, and you guys are ready to play Minecraft. So hopefully this video helped you guys out. Make sure you guys give this video a like if it did, and if you guys are interested in these kind of things, um, how to install videos and stuff like that, make sure you guys subscribe to do a lot of these kind of videos. All right, so I'll see you guys later. See ya.